Hello, welcome to the February 2020 Gifted Group Universal Sphere. Whether you hear a lot, whether you are here live or watching later, the effects are the same. And the reason why is that energy work uh, does not uh, have the constraints of time or space. And as a reminder, you will not be learning how to do Universal Sphere today. That being said, you will have an experience of receiving you know, a Universal Sphere. And I trust that you will enjoy it. My name is Scott Walker. I am a Universal Sphere instructor based out of Banff, Alberta, Canada. And I'm grateful that you're here right now, whether it is live or whether you're listening later. And as you can tell, this is an audio only call. So do not be concerned about watching today. This is a, a feeling process, not a thinking process. So I personally feel that having the least amount of senses engaged is ideal. What I'd like you to do now is take a note of how you're feeling. Are you feeling excited? Are you feeling stressed? Are you feeling inspired, overwhelmed? So take a quick note of how you're feeling right now. And with this call today, you can essentially ask for energetic support around whatever you would like. Some examples are something you'd like to focus on during February. It could be something you'd like to let go of this month. It could also be supercharging an area of your life that's going really well. Another option is getting energetic support around your primary 2020 intention. So I'd like you to, again, take a note, either with pen and paper or on your phone or computer, of what you would desire to receive energetic support around during this call. So I'll give you a, a little bit of time for that. And again, it could be anything. It could even, could even be a specific situation that is coming up in your life right now, either really good or not ideal. And you could be asking for support around that. So it's totally up to you. It's 100% your choice, what you desire energetic support around. So like I say, please take a note of that, either mentally or on paper or some digital form. And now that you've noted how you're feeling and what you would like energetic support around, I'll ask you to close your eyes. And we're gonna get nice and relaxed. So ideally you're in a comfortable space that is as quiet as it can be. And I'd encourage you to turn off any notifications that you can on your phone, computer, etc. And really be fully present for you. Because by you here being live or watching the recording, you're essentially saying that, that you matter and that you desire to receive this support. So as you're easing into this and getting settled, getting comfortable, take some nice deep breaths. So really feel full breaths coming from deep in your belly. And as you're inhaling, you're inhaling expansion and possibility. And as you're exhaling, you're letting go of anything that's not serving you. At your own pace, continue a few nice deep breaths. So we're breathing in possibility and expansion. And breathing out anything that's no longer serving you. 
be it thoughts or things happening in your life. So continue deep breathing and I'm going to start creating this universal sphere. And as I'm doing this, I'm truly grateful to be here now. And I'm grateful that there are some of you here live. So thank you for, for coming. And as I'm creating this sphere, I'm doing my best and everything I can to move from my head space to my heart space. As with all energy work, the universal sphere is a feeling process. So I'm moving out of my rational mind into my, my heart space. And as I'm creating this fear, I'm just really filled with an immense sense of gratitude today. I'm grateful to be here now. I'm grateful to be, to be able to share this incredible gift with all of you. I'm grateful for many other things. And as you're listening here, be it live or on the recording, if you find that your mind is drifting off and thinking about different things, be gentle with yourself and just bring your mind back to the feeling process. Really encouraging you to be fully present and to strictly be focusing on your breathing. And as I'm creating this fear, I am feeling the energy starting to build. And the universal sphere is connecting with solution energy. Solution energy supports us. 24-7. It's constantly bathing us in love and support. And by doing this sphere right here, right now, we're making a conscious connection with this solution energy. One way to think of it is that we're connecting with our our spiritual support team. And it's a team that's always cheering us on, that's always there. And the majority of people do not have the ability or a way to consciously connect with that team. So here today, we are connecting with that team. So if, if you can imagine hundreds or even thousands of people cheering you on, what does that feel like? I know with me, I, I feel really grateful and really excited knowing that there is so many, so much support for me and everyone 
all the time. So I'm going to be quiet for a few breaths here and just really feel the, focus on this feeling of being fully supported by this team. And as a reminder, this virtual support team, spiritual support team, I'll say, it has nothing but unconditional love for you. And they are constantly giving you unconditional support. So really let that sink in. a 24 7 source of unconditional love and unconditional support isn't that a great feeling So I'm really starting to feel this energy build. I'm just going to hold it a little bit longer. So again, continue to focus on your breathing. If your mind drifts off to a thought, let that go and come back to being present and focusing on deep belly breaths. I'm just starting to release this sphere. As I do, remain still, continue your deep breathing. And as the energy is being released, it's an outward expansive energy. It's going into every cell of your body, permeating every cell of your body. It's also adding love and light to the world. And it's raising your personal vibration. And thankfully, it's also raising my personal vibration. So with it being an outward expansive energy, I receive that energy as well. As this energy is, is entering your body, you may or may not be feeling anything. And when I say feeling, I mean physically feeling. So if you are not feeling anything, that is okay. If you are feeling something, that is okay. Please honor whatever feelings you are not or you are feeling. Everyone's experience is different. And what I'd like you to do now is bring to mind your intention for this call. Be it something you'd like to supercharge, something you'd like to let go of. Your 2020 intention, etc. So bring that to mind, what you thought of before this process. And feel that happening. So the, here you can visualize it happening, you can feel it happening, you know that it's happening. And I'd like you to be grateful that it has happened, whatever it is. So focus on that feeling of being of gratitude 
for it having already happened. And what I'd love you to, to do now is to bring yourself back to the physical space. So you can wiggle your fingers, fingers and toes. You can do some light stretches. Bring yourself back. And whenever you feel ready, please open your eyes. And we're still on audio only. So you're not seeing anything on the call. But I would love for you to take a note of how you're feeling. So are you feeling expanded? Are you feeling calm? Are you feeling grounded? Are you feeling excited? How are you feeling? And if you recall, take a note and compare that to how you're feeling before this process. So for any of you watching live or the recording, um, if you're comfortable, I would greatly appreciate you sharing in the comments how you're feeling before or after. And if you'd like to state what your energetic intention was for this call, that's wonderful. If not, that's quite all right. And for those of you who are brand new to Universal Sphere, if you would like to learn more about it, please click on the Universal Sphere public Facebook page. There's all kinds of videos and there's upcoming online classes. One of them is the next one is on Sunday, February 9th. And I really thank you for being here today. So I trust that you enjoyed this process. I know I did. And, uh, create a wonderful rest of your day, whatever you're up to. Thank you and take care.